Hey guys, it's time for a brew. <sighs> Fantastic. I'm in a great mood. Um, I'll tell you why. Uh, it's pretty much just things that's been happening lately. Uh, definitely today, as or should say tonight. Um, very happy because I got to make a video for you guys, of course. Um, so I'm able to do that. Uh, bowling started, as I mentioned in my last video, and it was fantastic. Uh, such a great time. Um, I'm bowling like an every other week with another guy that's on this team, um, which I had never done that. I've been bowling only, only been bowling for like two years. All right, this is my third year, and it's great. Uh, I mean, I love bowling and everything. Uh, not that great. I uh, hold. For any of you bowlers out there, I hold a 162 average at the moment. At the moment, um, obviously, when you start a league up, uh, or you know, when you start in your league for the season, you have a few weeks there where you're trying to figure out your new average for this year. And uh, the cool thing is for me, and to give you a quick little history, I again, I had, I haven't, I've really seriously actually been bowling. I want to say actually been bowling because two years ago I said, oh, there's a thing I can get on with leagues. That'd be cool. I like bowling, but I never had I never had a ball. Uh, like my own ball, really. I mean, I kind of do. Uh, I guess I do have my own ball, but I never really had a true, like, I never had like a curve ball. And so I wanted to get one of those. So I ended up getting one of those literally like weeks before bowling for the first time. Uh, in league, but any time before that, it was very, very rare. Like I might bowl once a year, maybe, uh, maybe twice a year, ever. I mean, <laughs> like it's mind-boggling to think that I literally have been bowling for like two years, actual serious, actually been trying to bowl. Um, otherwise, it was like little family parties or whatever. Uh, sometimes I ended up on the bumper lanes, sometimes not. Um, I had no idea what I was doing. And so anyways, I got into a league, and I'm like, all right, I'm going to learn this way. Two feet, you know, both feet first, just jump in and do it. And so I got in, I was bowling, and I got, I was getting, I sucked at the beginning, obviously. I was horrible. And I got up to a certain point where I was like, all right, I'm starting to understand some things. And of course... Because YouTube is the most awesome place ever. I watched so many different YouTube videos to try to learn how to throw differently. Um, so no one was really helping me at the time, so I felt like I had to teach myself, and that's really the best way for me to learn. Uh, so I watched a bunch of stuff, figured it out, and I went from having like a 113, 116 average, and bumped it up like right away. Um, to like the 130s, 130s, 140s area, and then I got the most improved award for that league um, the first year. Second year did the same thing. Literally, I I think it was like a couple pins difference, and I and I did it again. I doubled. I I, like, I doubled up. I did the same thing as I did last year, and like not double, literally doubled my average, but I jacked it all the way up there into the 160s. And then last year, and then this year, I probably this this last year I didn't. Um, do that, but I got I got two years in a row, um, so it's pretty cool. I mean, it's definitely really awesome. Uh, but anyways, this group that I'm bowling with is great. Sorry, the whole thing's like bowling about bowling here, um, but this group is great. Um, the, the, the the league I was on or the group I was with last year, they were okay at first, but I knew this was not this could not be the team that was going to carry me into getting better, and definitely not the team that I can completely rely on to be happy with bowling because the team I was on just I don't know a bunch of there was a guy on the team that nobody really liked <laughs> um, you know he'll never watch these videos so I don't really care at this point um, but nobody likes him okay he's really annoying really loud and I definitely clashes with me because I am not a loud person I like to be very quiet and everything the loudest thing I do um, probably at all is this this is about the loudest thing I get uh, so this guy just really kind of get got on everyone's nerves. I was pretty calm about it, but anyways, this this group they're really nice and they're all really good bowlers. So the idea that 
if I do something wrong, they can actually tell me what to do to fix it and what I'm doing wrong. Like they can actually pick it out. So, anyways, it, it's just really cool. It's a really great night, and I'm very happy about that. Um, quick thing, really quickly. I, I just don't know if you guys know this. There's this thing called Triscuits, not sponsored. Uh, but these guys, I I haven't had these since I was a kid, and I started eating them again. And uh, take it with t take it with me, uh, obviously because I own them. Uh, but it's so good, it's so good. Oh man. Anyways, <laughs> I trying to think what else happened today. Oh, people are lazy with their computers. I found out, which I think I've always known this. I just I keep hearing it more and more. Uh, basically, people that wanting to plug in a thing, no matter what device it is, something some sort something with storage, right? They want to plug it in to their system, and then instantly import it, magically put it everywhere in their system where it's supposed to go, without trying. Literally from the time plugging in, and then, and then, I don't want to touch a thing. I don't want to touch a thing. Why is this a thing in general? Why is this it? Why is this? Why is this how people want to use their systems? I I don't get it. And before you say, well, you just know more about computers than those people. This is very true. But at the same time, how can you seriously sit there and just plug it in and think everything is just supposed to work magically without your intervention in any way? That just makes no sense to me. You know, and, and basically the idea that I had to tell this guy and I told other people, you know, it's just copy and paste. It's not hard. You know, it's it's four, well, five, six steps, whatever, but, you know, I know it's more than just plugging it in or expecting things to work, but anyways, that soapbox is for my second channel that I never do anything with, apparently, because I'm lazy. Procrastination is a disease, uh, by the way. Uh, so what else really happened? Really nothing else. I mean, it was pretty chill, pretty chill day. Uh, got some stuff done, keeping caught up. This is great. Um, I have decided on, I have decided, I've made a decision. There's some people that know me know this is really tough. I don't, I'm really bad at making decisions for stuff. Really am. Uh, the dentist was hard enough. Uh, that took me months to finally say, hey, I have insurance. Maybe I should use this, right? There's so many things that are covered. I should just do it. You know, it's like, hey, you can do this thing whenever you want. It's completely free. You can do this whenever. So do it whenever. Oh, okay. Months later, I finally do it. All it was is I just had to show up. I literally just had to show up and things get and things happen. Can I do that? No, of course not. Uh, so yeah, I'm. That's all I got. That's all I got, guys. Uh, hopefully, I can eventually get my system to be able to handle streaming. I thought it was ready to go because I've, I've tried it a few times. I thought it was working, but so I need to upgrade my RAM or something, from what I can tell. And hopefully. By that time, I can start doing some streaming of some games. I got a couple things in the works in my head. Like I know what I want to stream. So, uh, yay! My other my other video is almost uploaded. Obviously, I'm doing these like every other day. Like I record it now, and I'll upload this like tomorrow, which will be Thursday at the time when you see this pop up. But uh, it's just easier. It makes it easier for my time management to be able to do that instead of trying to figure this all out and then sit here till 11, 11.30, midnight, whatever, waiting for it to upload. Because my upload is real low. Uh, but anyways, I hope you guys had a great day. Um, we're just over the hump. we got two more days. And then the weekend. Yay! And I just found out I don't have to work Saturday. Woot! So I will talk to you guys later. Bye!